University 101, Section 40, Group 4. Hello, my name is Magdalena Flores. My topic is suicide among teenagers. I decided to choose this topic because suicide is one of the leading causes of death among teenagers and adolescents. In my first article, it is called Preteen Alcohol Use Initiation and Suicide Attempts Among Middle and High School Students. Basically, it talks about how teenagers were able to commit suicide. This being said, they use some sort of drug such as alcohol or overdosing on pills to commit suicide. In the article, it states that alcohol use has been linked to suicide attempts among youth, meaning teenagers and high school students. Also, alcohol use is a well-established risk factor for suicide and suicidal behavior among the adolescents. Overall, I thought this article was interesting because they went in depth about how many teenagers were able to commit to killing themselves and how they were able to do it. In my second article, A Methodological Study of Family Needs following the suicide of a teenager. This article talks about a story that concluded with a teenager dying due to bullying. Besides talking about the story, they gave helpful hints about what to look for if you think someone is or might be suicidal. For example, they might say something like, life would be better without me, or something as obvious as I want to kill myself. Another thing to look out for might be a sudden change in mood, so being depressed a large portion of the time. What I thought was interesting is that it said about 30,000 people die of suicide in the U.S. and about 1 million worldwide. And finally, my last article is a website called save.org. It has some statistical information about suicide. For example, many who attempt suicide never seek professional care, while 80% of people that seek treatment for depression are treated successfully. There are twice as many deaths due to suicide than HIV or AIDS. 15% of those who are clinically depressed die by suicide. There are an estimated 8 to 25 attempted suicides to one completed. One in 65,000 children ages 10 to 14 commit suicide each year. Last year, SAVE educated 10,618 youth and parents on depression and suicide prevention. And finally, this is what the SAVE.org website looks like. If you'd like to know more about it, you should check it out. So that is my University 101 project. I hope that you've enjoyed it and have a nice day and that's it.